And we're recording, I believe. All right. What's up, everybody? Zach back here again for another reaction video. So, um, a lot of you guys like the Poppy video. Yeah, you guys really did like the Poppy video. So, today, I'm not going to do another Poppy. A lot of you guys are requesting it, but I'll do that in another video. But I've been putting off this one for so long. That all my friends are mad at me that I have not listened to it yet. So I'm going to be listening to a Data Remember's new track uh, called Degenerates. So I know it's kind of crazy that I have not uh, done it yet. But you know what? I've been holding it off for you guys because I wanted to an actual video just with you guys and just like getting my honest review on it. I've heard. Bad reviews, I've heard good reviews, I've heard mixed emotions. But, uh, you know what? Screw it. We're gonna go right into it. So, here we go. Uh, hopefully... Of course. <laughs> I like my... Oh. No, one, no one cares. So, now my let's get into it. Okay. Why do we tend to hurt one another? It's very, very poppy so far. very to the point when it comes to this song. Okay. So the chorus is very easy to follow, so that's very good for people who don't know what they don't remember as much. Still a little heaviness in there, there's still slight heaviness for it. It's a good melody, really. It's a good bopper, like forth like this. It has a good melody. Uh, very easy chorus to follow. Oh. Is this the build up for a breakdown? I don't know if a really heavy breakdown would be good for this. Okay. This is a, like a good type of breakdown for this. It's a very chorusy break down or are you gonna go back into it now? Now my friends are the course. Okay, so I can kind of see where people don't like it. I could actually, I could actually understand where people don't like it because, um, well, I can't really compare the last album because the last album was not as great as we all hoped it would be. But, um, shoot, like, like common courtesy. Perfect blend of pop, metal, 
all that. But as uh, if people don't notice about it, that they're not independent anymore on their own independent label. They're actually with Fueled by Ramen now. So that could take place on why it's more on the poppy route, I can understand. Um, maybe they brought someone else along the line for their... Uh, production for this song uh, we have no idea this honestly just could be this song and the rest of the album that they're gonna release or whatever they're releasing could be like heavy as balls could be just heavy as balls really we don't really know but just, i mean i i like it it's i'm not gonna say that it's bad because i was bobbing to it it has a good chorus it has a good chorus breakdown for it that was needed um, the verses this is all good, like very nice, uh, nice tempo for it. Um, Jeremy's voice sounds great on it. Uh, there's still heaviness parts to it, like the breakdown was a good portion of it. And then in between the verses, you have a little bit of chugging in the background if you don't even notice it. But I still think it's an all around good song that they released. And people are getting so mad because, like, oh, they're falling off their roots and all that. But People have to understand that in order to be in a successful band, you have to go along with the times. So, I mean, look at like look at an example like Chelsea Grin. Chelsea Grin was just straight up. Just, I don't even know how to explain them. Just raw, and then they put singing in it, and it's. It's completely changed to what Chelsea Grin is used to because they were they're going with the times now, like a day to remember now is because they just did a song with Marshmallow and that was awesome. That opens that opens so many doors for bands to like open with like different shows, different genres of shows, and that's like the coolest thing that a day to remember and Marshmallow could have done for the music scene is being able to play DJ music uh, with. I mean, with electronic music, to with, like, rock and roll, or, like, with metal, and with, with a day to remember, like, it's, 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 like, crazy. The fact that they actually got together, sat down, made a song together, and released it to the public. That was the first song that they made in, like, years. And it was a good song. It was a banger. I loved it. I don't care what anybody else says. I love both, I love both of these songs right now. So, but, um, that's how I feel. Song was great. I loved it. I'm definitely gonna be jamming it to it uh, from now on. Um, I will be doing. I will be going back to Poppy. I will go back to Poppy because I know a lot of you guys were commenting a bunch of freaking uh, songs, but I've already done. Uh, I've done Scary Mask already. I've already listened to Scary Mask, so I wouldn't. I wasn't able to shoot it because it's it's already done. So, but I enjoyed it. Um, leave, leave some more comments down below of what other songs I should look up or what other bands maybe I should look up or just what I should do in general, maybe. So, but thanks for watching you guys and, uh, see you guys later. Bye.